You know, most of what I do is uh, microcar based, but every now and then something fun kind of finds me that's not. I, I'm not the saying that I don't have fun with other cars, but microcars really rock my world. This is a 1929 Model A pickup truck. It's got bright orange wheels, black fenders. It's uh, been restored at one point in its life. It is just the coolest thing. A uh, customer brought this in. Hadn't been running for years and years and years. And I got it going. Uh, and I have to say, I'm a bit smitten with the old truck. Uh, again, it's a 1929 Ford. Got the lights working, got it running. And I thought that uh, since my customer wants me to put some miles on it before he drives it home, we could take it for a little drive. Now, I have a tough enough time filming and driving in a normal car, but one of these things, holy cow. Let's see if I can start it up for you. We'll go for a little drive. <clears throat> Very simple. Very simple indeed, but the starting procedure is a little difficult. <clears throat> so what we do, push in the clutch first, Turn the key on. I have to see if I can hold. I'm going to give it a little bit of advance and a little bit of throttle. And then here we go with the foot starter down there where my toe is. Yeah, yeah, I got it running. Okay, I got to give it full advance. I got a gear shift. And we got a horn. You hear that? All right, let's take it for a little drive. I think I can do this. Make sure nobody's coming. really hard to film and shift. Barely keep all my senses going here. But while we got it running, I'll go out and open the hood. You can hear it. Put the brake on. There she is, an old flathead. It's got a bit of an exhaust leak. Cool distributor cap. And an updraft carburetor. I like these little side lights. Okay, so I'm going to shut her down, turn the advance off, turn the key off. Here it is. Again, not a truck you see every day. 1929 Model A pickup, right there.